second tip that I use from Julie that I think is really great. What she said, that is when people get to be really disorganized, and we're not just talking about a weekend where time got away from you, but where you really feel like you're stepping over stuff and it's just really unorganized and it doesn't feel good to be living in that space. She said oftentimes what's happening is that all the stuff that you see around you, it doesn't have a home. It doesn't have a specific spot that you've designated, you know, here's going to be where I keep this. this. So it's just getting in the habit and getting in the practice of everything having a home, from your remotes to your TV, your paperwork, your clothing, whatever it is, kind of looking around. Now, in the book, she's got tons of great advice for, you know, the containers that you would use for each of these. And so there's so much more in here. But that one thing was so simple, and I have always used it. So if I'm bringing something new into the home, where there's a new kitchen gadget or a new book or whatever, I better make sure I have space for it. And I want to make sure that I have a home for it so I can keep everything else organized.